Welcome to Skinny TV on YouTube once again. Let's take the latest news coming in from the camp of Chelsea Football Club. Yes, my own Chelsea. Things are not really going on well for us this season. But Chelsea have announced the signing of Ghanaian winger Ato Ampa. And yesterday, many Ghanaians were excited. Everyone was reporting about it that Chelsea have signed this player. But the question remains. Will he represent Ghana? Well, we will talk about it. After his signing yesterday, the player has spoken. What did he say? We'll check it out. And also, one comment from a colleague player has given Ghanaians hope that this player will represent Ghana. What was the comment? What are the details? We also have another Ghanaian player who plays for the Chelsea Academy. And um, yes, he reacted. We will check out all the details and more in this video. Before then, drop us a like. Whenever you join us, please like the video after liking. If you are new, then you subscribe. You put on the post notification bell on all for more updates on this channel. Also, if you are interested in starting a business online and you lack ideas, just visit margaretamor81.com. She is a business marketing consultant. After visiting the site, just register. After registration, you will be taken through a step-by-step -step procedure which will help you to establish a business online, a digital business. With this, you can earn money monthly from online. So, you can just pick the numbers on your screens, contact Margaret Amor for more details as well. Now, yesterday afternoon, Chelsea signed the Ghanaian winger Ato Ampa. Yes, he is just 17 years of age and um, he's a Ghanaian youngster who plays very well for the Chelsea Academy. This is his first professional contract with Chelsea and he has committed his future to the Premier League club until 2025. Yes, the 17-year-old attacking midfielder has progressed through the ranks at the Blues Academy, having joined at the age of 10. And um, it has been seven years that the player has been improving in Chelsea. Ampa has been a regular fi uh, figure for the Chelsea under 18 side this season and has caught the eye with his impressive performances. He's eligible to represent both England and Ghana. Yes, he's eligible to play for both England and Ghana because he was born in Ghana here, Accra. And um, the youngster, um, you know, his entourage was quick to reach agreement with Chelsea Youth Academy and the management and um, the club announced the contract signing, as I said already yesterday afternoon. The deal runs until June 2025 and Chelsea are excited about the potential of the academy graduates. According to Chelsea, they describe him as a very quick and dynamic attacking player. Ampa um, has scored in Chelsea's under 18 this season. Um, he scored his first goal when Chelsea under 18 were defeated by five goals to two to Fulham in the Premier League under 18 competition on April 26, taking his tally to two goals and five assists in 13 league games this season. So out of 13 matches, the player has scored two goals and also provided five assists. That is seven goal contribution. That is a good one for the player. He made his under 18 debut for the Blues last year featuring in a total of five games and this season he has you know had 13 already and that is good for him chelsea as i said the signing of ampa shows that they will continue to promote players from the academy to join the senior team now which comments came before then and we also have some Ghanaian players who have been playing chelsea the likes of you know christian achucha some delayed may he so rest in power then um we also had baba abdurrahman who also played for chelsea but the biggest of all is michael asian who played for chelsea as well and did a lot chelsea has promoted some academy players the likes of macy mount ray james um tammy abraham callum hassan and the others in recent times and they continue to produce a lot now after his signing yesterday the player came to post on his official instagram account and this is what he wrote there he says special moments for my family and i signing a professional contract with chelsea fc um come a long way um it was all a dream then it became a reality that is what he actually said god bless the journey he added now after this then um one player his name is joshua kofi echampo 
Joshua Kofi Echampon. He is a Ghanaian and um, he also plays for Chelsea Academy. He has been representing the England under 15 on many occasions. He just came to comment, my boy, with the Ghana flag attached to it. And many were asking, is he going to represent Ghana? Because that Tuampa as well as George Kofi Echampon, let me put it on record that they both represented England under 15 already. They've both represented England under 15, but that doesn't rule out the fact that they can still represent Ghana. Um, George Kofi Achampo, especially if you check out his profile picture and everything, it's all about England, England, England. He has been represented, you know, the three lions and um, youth size on many occasions. His colleague coming to comment under his post that my boy with the Ghana flag, many were saying that that means that the player might be representing ghana because if you check out ato ampers um official profile he has added the ghana flag and others telling you that yes the player will still be checking out on ghana so we only hope that ghana we can get a very good plan for him convince him to represent the nation but for now he has been representing the england under 15 and now he will be eligible to represent the england under 18 and that is the update for you on this channel so he's eligible to represent both nations but um i think the nation that will really convince him enough that will give him a good plan on his improvement as a player or development as a player the player might be ready to join them and that is the latest update for you he has signed his first professional contract with chelsea football club until 2025 and as we know already we have some players who have switched nationality to join ghana even though the player um he is yet to reach the state that he will have to switch nationality but we all know and um, we have Tarek Lamptey switching from england to ghana we also have Inyak Williams switching from Spain to Ghana. We had Yeboa Konisdorfer, Ransford, who also switched from Germany to Ghana. Um, Stephen Ambrose or Stefan Ambrose, who also switched from Germany to Ghana. Then Patrick Pfeiffer. These are the notable players in recent times who have switched to Ghana. And um, we continue to pursue um, the player in the name of Callum Hassan Odoi, who plays for Chelsea but currently unknown at Bayer Leverkusen. Um, he is also yet to switch to Ghana by Ghana. We are really chasing him to switch. Then, um, Edin Ketia, the striker for Arsenal, he is also yet to switch. So, some of these players, you know, they begin from the academies in England, and by the time we realize they are representing the, you know, the England national team, and it is understandable because they have been invited to join under 15, under 17, up to the senior level. So, you could see that there is a clear plan of development for these players. That is why it makes it really difficult for Ghana to get them whenever they reach their peak. So, that's the latest news on Ato Ampa. Will he play for Ghana? The question will still remain, but let's only hope and wish him well on his development that he will grow to become a very top notch winger as well. Don't forget to like the video, let me know your comment in the comment section. Subscribe if you are new, put on the bell for more updates here on this channel. This is Kenny TV. And of course, we shall meet later.